hi I'm Sharon and welcome back to my channel in this video I wanted to sh come on and show you some of the um, recent art journals that I've I've put together I'm finding um, I'm having a lot of fun at the moment do with a lot of experimenting I'm trying out different styles different formats and this first one comes from the long slim format idea that I was I really enjoyed when I with the smaller um, art journal that I've a recent uh, altered book that I recently finished and I'll leave a link below if you want to check that out um, but what I wanted was a book that could be a showcase for a lot of the lovely papers that I've been putting aside um, jelly printed and stenciled papers that I've been putting aside and this is this is a showcase for them I'm coming back in and I'm doing a little bit of extra work over the top of the papers but mainly it's just just a place to um, have a look at these lovely papers I'm adding some stamping as you notice this journal was put together with random pages the way that I love to do put together my books a lot of these papers are also experiments with new stencils that I've I've created with the wonderful Cricut machine that I was gifted stencil there one of the things that I've realized recently that was that I have a huge stencil collection and I mean I mean adding even more to that by um, creating my own and I rarely scratch the surface of what I own so a lot of the work that I'm doing lately is been pulling out those stencils and actually using them another one of my stencils I'm also work um, experimenting with div different color combinations some of these are my palette papers I just love flipping through these types of books and looking at the variation is one of the things that I'm trying to do with this particular book is to never repeat a paper and on the subject of stenciling I also um, took this old accordion concertina sketchbook that I had lying around and I painted it up and I've um, put together a bit of a reference to all the stencils in my stencil library This was a bit of fun. And I just need to get this out and remind myself every now and again of what I do have in my collection to use. So, 
and then these two I put together recently just little mini art journals and they're mainly used I mainly used um, jelly print roll-off papers papers that I've um, cleaned my brayer cleaned my brush off a little bit of stamping and stenciling cleaned off my stencils and these are just general little art journals they'll have a bit of a play in it's amazing what a wonderful background roll off papers can make and these have a canvas paper and paper backed cover and this one pages from an old atlas As with all my art journals, I love starting my pages with something on them. Gives me a jumping off point, some colours to work with, gives me some ideas. So that's my latest art journals. I'm having so much fun just playing and experimenting. And i hoping these might have inspired you to put together some of your own similar little play journals. So thanks for watching and bye for now.